Blackfacts.com presents LGBTQ plus pioneers. William Dorsey Swan. William Dorsey Swan was an American gay liberation activist. Born into slavery, he was the first person in the United States to lead a queer resistance group and the first known person to self-identify as a queen of drag. During the 1880s and 1890s, Swan organized a series of balls in Washington, D.C. Most of the attendees of Swan's gatherings were men who were formerly enslaved and were gathering to dance in their satin and silk dresses. Because these events were secretive, invitations were often quietly made at places like the YMCA. Swan was arrested in police raids numerous times, including in the first documented case of arrests for female impersonation in the United States, on April 12, 1888. In 1896, he was falsely convicted and sentenced to 10 months in jail for keeping a disorderly house, i.e., running a brothel. After his sentencing, he requested a pardon from President Grover Cleveland. This request was denied, but Swan was the first American on record who pursued legal and political action to defend the LGBTQ community's right to gather. Swan was known to have been close with Pierce Lafayette and Felix Hall, two men who had also both been enslaved and who formed the earliest documented male same-sex relationship between enslaved Americans. When Swan stopped organizing and participating in drag events, his brother continued to make costumes for the drag community. Two of his brothers had been active participants in Swan's drag balls. Swan died in 1925 in Hancock, Maryland. After his death, local officials burned his home. Learn more at blackfacts.com.